Welcome to Aditya's Corner. Today we'll see how to crochet pants. Now we are going to start our work with the pants. Here I have made a base chain of 95 and now I'm going to join this. Make sure that it's not twisted. Now here I'm going to make slip stitch in the first chain. Insert your hook into the first chain and make a slip stitch. Now for row 1, chain 1 and work 1 half double crochet in each stitch. In the same space, make 1 half double crochet. In the next, again half double crochet and continue working 1 half double crochet in each stitch till the end of this row I'll show you what to do next we have made our first row of half double crochet now join with a slip stitch on top of first half double crochet when we start working here this will be the bottom part and this will be the top. So the top edging do not look good. So what we are going to do is chain 2 and turn your work back. Now slip stitch into the first half double crochet. Here we are going to make a slip stitch in the first half double crochet here. So turn the work and make a slip stitch. So this will be the top line. Now we will continue working in the bottom half. So this will be the back that we did and this will be the front. So what we are going to do is flip your work and now this will be the correct row or uh, the facing side will be the right side. So here again what we are going to do is chain 1 and in the first half double crochet make a front post half double crochet and the first one over Put the hook down front and bring it again to the front and make a half double crochet. This is the first half double crochet. That is front post half double crochet. Again, yarn over. Insert the hook from behind. This will be a back post. So insert the hook from behind and again. This will be second half double crochet that is back post and again from front to front will be the first front post or sorry second front post again a back post continue working front post and back post double crochets till you reach the end so this will be the elastic uh, waistband that we are making will start from the top side. So the waistband and then the leg part will continue. So continue working front and back post half double crochet in each stitch alternatively. I am going to work this same round several times 
till I reach the size of my waistband. So continue working this way and I'll meet you after few rows. I'll tell you how many rows I have made. Here we have made our last stitch. To join what we are going to do is make a front post slip stitch. In the first the double cross, sorry, half double crochet here, insert the foot from front to back and again from back to front and make a slip stitch. So here this will be our first front post. Make a chain one. You can make chain two and count this as our first half double crochet. So the next will be back post, half double crochet, again front post, half double crochet, back post, and continue working this way all around. Here our waistband is made. I have made five rows of front post and back post double crochet. Here we have finished our waistband. Now we'll start working our uh, pants. So here I have a total of 96 stitches. Counting this chain 2 as my first stitch I have 96. So we are going to make a slip stitch on top of this chain 2. And make a chain of 3. In this row we are going to work with double crochets so chain 3 and on top of each stitch we are going to make one double crochet. The hip part will be an increasing row so these uh, stitches are in multiples of 8 so every 8 stitch I am going to make an increase. So this will be our first double crochet, second, three, four, five, six, and seven. The eighth stitch will be an increase. We are going to make two double crochets into the same stitch. Again in the next seven make one double crochet each. So this will be the pattern we are going to follow in this row. One double crochet in the first seven stitches and in the eighth stitch we will make an increase and continue working this way till you reach the end of this row. We have made our first row of double crochet. Now join with a slip stitch on top of chain 3. Again, chain 3 and continue working one double crochet on top of each stitch. So here we'll be working one double crochet in each stitch till I reach my uh, length. I'll meet you at the end. Here I have made 12 rows of the body. Uh, before we get into the leg partition, I am going to make one row of decrease. So we will start working with the decrease row now. Chain 3, counting as first double crochet. One double crochet in the next. Two. Three. Six and 
7. In the 8th and 9th, we are going to make a decrease. So, yarn over and do not complete your double crochet. Again, yarn over into the next stitch. Pull through two. We have three loops on the hook. Yarn over and pull through all two. This one counts as one double crochet. So in this manner we are going to work in this row. Working one double crochet in the next seven stitches and in the eighth and ninth together we are going to make one double crochet. So continue this sequence and I will meet you at the end of this row here. Here I have made one row of decrease. You can also decrease uh, if you want a leggings type uh, pant. I am going to make a parallel band, so I am not going to make any more decreases. So continue working in this row. Now we are going to make the neck partition. In this row, I have a total of 96 stitches. So we are going to divide this into two partitions. So continue working with one double crochet in each stitch for 48 stitches. That is 96 by 2 which will be 48 stitches. We are going to work one double crochet each. Here we have made one double crochet in each for the first 48 stitches. Count and check if there are remaining, sorry, 48 stitches. Count and check for this side also if there is 48 stitches. Now we are going to join this. Now here, take the first chain 3, 1, 2, 3. On top of this chain 3, we are going to make a slip stitch and join it. So this makes a one partition. In the same way, we are going to do this one also. Continue working one double crochet in each stitch till you reach the desired height.
hope this video will be useful for you. Do subscribe my channel and click the bell button for notifications of the videos. Thank you.